too easy Shades on, hat low, gold chains Got me feeling like a me Yo guys And um, yeah, today we're straight into the workout today So you can see me doing squats Got the, the big boy cameraman Adam in there in project, as you can see but Yeah guys, doing a few reps of squats Getting the muscles working yeah, and this is a workout today to work on speed and power for the football pitch because I play sports as you know yeah this is the first set of my squats this is two sets and just got straight into the workout today Again, this all it is is just 100 kg nothing too crazy and we're moving on to sumo deadlifts so this is another variation of deadlifts again legs a bit wider than normal for deadlift and you have your feet turned out and the hands in the middle and you lift yeah, and this one hits your glutes more, focuses more on your glutes, takes pressure off your lower back as well. So any lower back problems, this is a good one to go for as well. And yeah, this is a really good one to build up glute strength and glute strength and quads. So yeah, this is the sumo deadlift again. Just a couple reps on this one as well. Two mm. more sets there. Yeah. I'm tired. I'm tired. Next set. Now back into the next set. So yeah, we're going to continue again with the sumo deadlifts. Really great exercise to do. I actually quite like deadlifts. I think they might be my favourite exercise. It was either them or squats, but I think I do them way more than I do squats. So yeah, so deadlifts my go-to. And now I'm going to move on. Just work on the upper body. Just work on the strength and the power in the upper body. Again, you might have seen this one before in one of my other videos. Again, this is for the back, upper back. To sit down straight like on a chair, just bring your arms back and pull. Try and keep your hands by your ears. So again, thumbs by your ears, just pull back. And a few reps in this one. And then I'm gonna mix this one up with pull-ups. This pull-up one again take about four seconds to come up and a few seconds to come down. So these are slow pull-ups again, so you're gonna work your muscles up quite a bit more than just going up and down. So these are good pull-ups to do. So good super set, again, just working all your back muscles. And your shoulders and your core as well. Okay, this one sitting now is not easy. Go for heavy weight and try and keep yourself still and not fall back as well. And then once we get back into it again, do a few reps in here. Then we go straight into the pull-ups. Yeah, that's always good little dancing as well. Again, you go here slowly up, slowly come down to control yourself. Slowly up, hold for a second or two, slowly back down. Okay, let's pull slowly up back down. Try those ones, so it's a good one to do for the pull ups. This one now, this is called the death march. This one works on your hamstrings. Again, powerful hamstrings means explosive speed. That's all it is. Strong hamstrings are really good. A lot of people are too much on their quads, so hamstrings are really important. But this one, it's a walking one. So the back leg, and if you can see properly, you bend the back leg, the front leg goes straight, and you bend down. So yeah, and then you sit down into it. So you sit down, back leg bends, front leg goes straight, and you just slowly come down to the bottom as far as you can. Again, it's gonna work on your hamstrings. As take this one, just start light so you use the movement. Once you feel comfortable, just go heavy and do your walk. So walk as far as you want to walk if you can handle it. Yeah, that's a death march. And now we're on to the TRX, working with stability again. This one's press ups, just add enough variation to the press ups. TRX is a really good piece of equipment as one you can take outside. Don't even nothing else. Take to the park, work on your core, power. Again, great exercise to do. Just to get my press ups, get me stronger on the top half, get me more explosive as well at the same time. So you get that upper body power. Okay, this one done a few reps on this, and then I mixed it up with doing abs as you're gonna see coming in the next video, next clip. Here we go, next clip. Again, just working on my side of my abs. Again, for my twist and turn and for that power on the pitch so no one can catch me. And then, so there's a few on the, on the right side, and a few on the left side. This one's a tough one for people. Again, if you can't do this one, just sit on the floor and do Russian twist. That's another good one to do. Sorry to the Americans out there. So I had a coach once, he calls it American twist. Doesn't say Russian at all. Now this exercise is called a depth jump. I'll say start on the lower box if you're not used to it. It's where you drop down on one foot and then bounce back up as quick as high as you can and as quick as you can. So that's power as well for any jumps that you're gonna do, for any explosive movements that you're gonna do on a pitch or just anywhere in life anyway. Like you might have to run and catch a bus. 
you don't want to miss the bus now so anything you do in life this can help as well especially in sports but this is everyday life you need to chase something chase someone chase your kids or ne nieces nephews so this is a really exercise to do yeah so you just take your time slowly drop down on one foot once you get to one foot just bounce up as high as you can and land and start again so as you can see slowly down drop both feet just bounce up no hands so you're working power just come from your legs so no no arms involved just everything's in the legs and yeah that's the little workout for today guys so yeah guys i'm in the gym video today here i was a bit tired after the gym so i didn't get to record the ending but i hope you liked that little video little workout enjoyed it hit that like button if you did subscribe for more content and i'll catch you guys in a bit peace